Shalom sisters, it's Jadida a Benjamite, and today I'll be showing you one of the most simplest ways to make fringes on your shirt. So let's get started. To begin, you're going to need your shirt, some fabric cutting scissors, some washi tape which you can get at the dollar store, and your ribbon of blue. I began by laying my shirt out on my table, and I want to show you the bottom of my shirt. See how it isn't completely even at the bottom? If your shirt is like this, you can still cut beautiful fringes. So the very first thing that I did, which I didn't record, was I put the shirt on and I wanted to see where on my body I would actually want my fringes to lie or how long they would be. So right here, I'm taking some chalk and I'm taking a ruler where I had marked when I was on my body and drew a straight line across. Now I am taking my washi tape and I'm lining it right directly on that line. You can use a ruler to measure the length of your fringes as well. To begin cutting your fringes, you can simply eyeball the thickness or do as I am doing here and taking my ruler and measuring on the tape with a sharpie every quarter of an inch. And you can do this for the whole length of the tape, but for me, I will stop and simply eyeball the rest. As you can see here, I've already cut down the seam of my shirt, but don't unravel the shirt at the seam, just cut it, okay? Now, I'm going to cut both the back and the front of the shirt as I cut up to make a fringe. I'm going to stop directly at the bottom of the tape. I'm not gonna cut through it. I'm gonna stop right at the tip of that tape. See how easily the washi tape is coming off the fringes without tearing? That's why you want the washi tape. Now simply loosen the fringes by pulling them. Now I am simply going to sew on my ribbon of blue. Here I am showing you how I am sewing on the ribbon. I am staying close to one edge, then on the other side I will stay close to that edge, not sewing one seam down the middle. Here I am showing you that I did not sew the ribbon all around the shirt. I stopped from one seam to the other seam so that my shirt won't become stiff and especially won't be hard to put on. So here, as you see, I am taking the scissors and cutting near the seam. I am making the cut a little higher than where the fringe is. And then I will wrap the other or the excess piece of the ribbon around that area. As you see me doing here. And now I am going to simply sew. And again, don't sew in the middle of the ribbon. Stay on the edges. All right, we're almost done. As you can see here, the ribbon is a little lumpy, so I'm going to iron it down. And there you have it, a wonderful shirt with a board blue and fringes. If you would like, send me a picture of one of your fringed garments, and I'll make sure to put it on in the next YouTube video. All you have to do is go to my blog, Jedida Benjamite, and contact me. The information and the blog description will be in the description box below. Shalom.